All right, funny highway signs. Yeah, what's going on here? Jeez, big drama here, guys. Oh, of course. Going to be a thing of the past. <laughs> In a move that's uh, dampening the mood on America's highways, the Federal Highway Administration. Federal Highway Administration. There's... Okay. Yeah. Uh, is putting, its acronym is FHWA. I guess they threw in the W from highway. Highway, two yeah. words maybe? Yeah. One word. The FHWA is putting the brakes on the use of humorous digital road signs. The signs, they say, known for eliciting smiles and chuckles from drivers nationwide. The digital. We've done this on the afternoon show, like some funny highway signs. Yeah, that we ha- we yeah, we've featured somewhere. those. Yeah. We're keeping that as a relic. They're facing some new, stricter guidelines. Uh, Gone are the days, they say, when a highway sign humorously advises drivers to slow down to arrive, to slow down to arrive late at the in-laws. Okay, there you go. Oh, little things. Slow down to arrive late at the in-laws. Right, I get it. Mm -hmm. I get how they would put that out (laughs) there, and it would be funny. Uh, What does that say? Use ya blinka. Use Use ya blinka. Okay, it's in Boston. Yeah, uh, that you makes sense. Blanca. You should blink. Uh, You're going to dunk. Or a New Jersey road sign that uh, reminded Halloween enthusiasts, Hocus Pocus, drive with focus. I like that. I mean, that would make me drive with focus. So they distract you with that sign? Apparently it's distracting. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, those are distracting. You spend too much time looking at them. You spend too much time laughing at them. Then you're distracted. You're not paying attention to the road. Yeah, because, I mean, all of those made me belly laugh. Definitely. <laughs> Within seconds, instantly, as you're driving yeah. on a hot 95 yeah. highway. The sign people have the sharpest senses of humor. Yeah. They have other things to focus on, like infrastructure or something, oh, like that potholes. Would be, yeah. That'd be a good yeah. one to yeah, worry about. Yeah, that would, actually. Yeah. Uh, contrary to what some may think, the FHWA argues that messages with secondary meanings, such as pop culture references or humorous content, should be eliminated. The concern is that these messages might take longer for drivers to process and understand, potentially distracting them from the road. So you're yeah. calling us stupid. Thanks yeah. a lot. Right. No, I mean, well, I can, I can most of us are stupid. You just put no cap on there, <laughs> and like my parents trying to figure that out, it might <laughs> make them wreck. Bruh. 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 No cap, bro. Nah, no cap. Yeah. No cap, bro. No cap. Put yeah. on the strap. Yeah. Yeah. But the, see? No. Yeah, that would that would confuse the hell out of my Yes, parents. it would. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yes, I it see would. that now. Do I have to take my hat off before <laughs> I put my seatbelt on? <laughs> put the cap on yeah. the pen, Harold. <laughs> <laughs> they said put all the caps on. Mm. <laughs> uh, oh, this uh the, the use your blinka. That's it is that that's mentioned in this one, Clay. Mm. Yeah. I think it's genius. That is pretty good. That's kind of funny. Spokesperson for the FHWA highlighted that the safety of all road users is the priority. States are expected to use good judgment in how they use changeable messages and signs for traffic safety and in the specific wording of these messages. I didn't see any of those being distracted, but I guess. No, those weren't too bad. I mean, Heather has a really good point. Like, I don't know if you've seen, like, Bucky's billboards, but they're also, like, funny and humorous. Are those signs going to be ostracized, too? Or that is this just, like, on the highway digital sign? Right, this is I, what they like can control as government. Yeah. yeah. It, it just like makes no sense digital. if we're going to have billboards, too. I mean, is that, I don't know, whatever. Well, maybe people don't want their government getting cheeky. I guess so. Maybe they, they just want their government to stick to governing. And like you said, Davey, working on infrastructure and the important stuff. Right. I'm not trying to tell a joke through a sign. God well, forbid, the, the people digitals have are looked at, and this is this is me trying to make sense of craziness of government decisions. I think the digitals are looked at for information, right? And advertisements are advertisement. Like like you yeah. you are focused on the digital. Like oh, what is it saying? There's an accident up ahead, and you're anticipating information. Okay, yeah. So I think that's the difference, but still, it's over the top. Yeah. 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 So. so say goodbye to yeah. all of our clever signs that I never see around here. I've never seen one. Bye. <laughs> Me neither. Bye. Me neither. Yeah. yeah. See you later. I think, the, I think the funniest advertisements uh, going to Orlando, the guy who does the vasectomies, and his name is Snipper. God, right. it's so yeah. funny, yeah. right? Yeah. Is that it's, still there? I didn't really see that on my way there. Oh, yeah. I know. It's, uh, just past, it's just past the flea market in Daytona as you go, get on, on to I-4. So funny. I still think our dermatologist in town has the best name for doing dermatology. Dr. Gross. Gross. Uh, the pimple popper. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. Ugh. Yeah, I played baseball at Flagler with 
two guys. One of them's name was Kevin Gross, and the other one was Greg Smell. And both of them had it, both of them had a great game. <laughs> the record put in Gross Smell wins game for Flagler. Oh, so and typical. It was yeah, this is so funny. It was it's hilarious. Great. That's awesome. But Greg was our Greg Smell was our third baseman, and Kevin was our pitcher, and it it was one of the most beautiful ads. <laughs> I, I wish I'd have kept it. Uh. Yeah, that sounds good. I've got a favorite headline that we did, but I won't share it on this show. <laughs> it's a great one, though. <laughs>